listen, if you look at this right here, you'll see that there's a rubber membrane underneath this drywall. This is a powder room. This is a toilet, trust me. If everybody's in the kitchen and I'm in this toilet, you don't want to hear me out there. You just don't, especially if they're eating, they'll be throwing up. So what he's done is he's insulated all of these walls and he took this heavy membrane and he put it on the outside of this bathroom. And then we drywalled on top of it. Now they make this stuff in drywall already. I have a piece of it at home and it's, uh, it's called Quiet Rock. And what they've done is they've taken two pieces of quarter inch drywall, they put a rubber membrane in between them, and then they sealed it all together and glued it all together, and it's 5 eighths, five -eighths thick, because you got two pieces of quarter inch, which is a half inch, and then this membrane gave it another eighth of an inch, so you've got 5 eighths of an inch thick drywall and they call it Quiet Rock. Now I've done theater rooms with this before, uh, but what we had to do, we hung a layer, this is before they came out with Quiet Rock too guys, I've been a wire, around a while, and they've invented stuff since I've started taking Quiet Rock as one of them. That didn't, that didn't exist when I was first doing drywall. But I read the specs and what we had to do is we had to hang a layer of 5 eighths, then, we stapled this on top of it, on top of the 5 eighths, and then we hung another layer of 5 eighths on top of it. And that's the way they told us to do that. Um, this here is, is, it'll work, it's gonna help a lot, but honestly, this membrane should be between two pieces of drywall. It doesn't matter if it's 3 eighths, if it's half inch, if it's 5 eighths, it doesn't matter, but it should be, even quarter inch, it should be between two pieces of drywall, not just against the studs, and then drywalled on top of it. But this is gonna be just fine. There's not gonna, he's not gonna have a problem with this. This is way better than not having it up there in the first place. Way better than not having that up there in the first place. But if you do do this, uh, consider putting it between two pieces of drywall rather than just fastening it on the studs and, um, and hanging drywall on top of it. Have a good day.